Hi everyone and welcome to this new video. I want to present you my latest design. It's a 3D printed for jet. It has uh, 1300 millimeters of length and weights around uh, 2.8 uh, kilograms with uh, a 6S 5000 battery. It's completely designed to be printed with uh, LWPLA, PLA, which is a foaming material that makes it uh, super, super light. Only the airframe uh, MT weights around uh, 1.1 uh, kilos. It has already flown uh, 10 15 times the goal was to make a an uh, edf jet that was uh, easy to print easy to assemble and easy to fly but also aerobatic and fast uh, if you want to the canopy is easily accessible with uh, just two magnets right here this is the first version i have designed there have been some uh, updates uh, on the second version which is uh, uh, getting printed by another pilot and uh, will be tested soon the main change uh, is about the battery bay, which uh, removes this part and gives the possibility to move the battery further back for CG. I painted it with uh, spray cans. I like it pretty much the way it came out. As said before, it's completely printed with uh, LWPLA, except for reinforcement like uh, the landing gear mounts. Uh, uh, also here and uh, some other parts like the servo horns which are uh, printed in uh, PTG. It has uh, two servos for each wing for the flap, one servo for each elevator, one rudder servo, the steering servo right here and uh, the retract set is from the free wing Avantis. The wing is uh, removable with those uh, four bolts here. The EDF hatch is uh, easily removable. There is a 90 millimeter EDF inside here and a uh, 120 amps ESC. Here is the EDF. Easy to remove and uh, put back. I have I had to put some tape because uh, in the second version I, I changed the position of the magnet to make it more uh, secure. It's gonna be powered by a 5000 uh, 6S battery um, which gives it um, like uh, around three three and a half minutes of uh, flight time. It will fit also a 6000 battery with no problem. As I said before uh, it has already around 15 flights and I'm super happy about how it flies. I didn't expect a 3D printed plane to fly this good, but you will see by yourself how it flies. So after turning on the radio, just install the battery. And let's just plug it in. As you've seen before, the canopy just uh, goes uh, with uh, with two magnets. And let's try everything, if everything works. Elevators, rudder, and no gear. Then we have ailerons, both of them, flaps, takeoff flaps and landing flaps. Uh, the retracts. Okay, and the EDF, perfect, good to go. The grass uh, is uh, pretty long, nobody cut it, so I hope, I hope it's gonna take off, let's see, wind, no wind. Echo flaps on. As you can see, the landing gear works perfectly on grass too, although it's pretty tall. Let's go. Easy. Let's start with a knife edge pass. So, full throttle. I have no gyro so it's uh, as you can see it's super super precise although no gyro so 
So now I'm gonna do a four point roll. Full throttle. Now, now I'm gonna do a loop, full throttle again, with a roll. Now I'm gonna make a full flap pass. So full flaps, low speed, I think I cut some grass. <laughs> As you can see, it has lots of power. I'm gonna make another slow roll pass. From here, so full throttle. Okay, so it's time to land. Let's start opening the flaps and the gear okay so now full flaps let's get aligned to the runway with some throttle on pull up the nose and we're, we're down Perfect. So let's check how much battery left we have. I have another uh, battery, not a 5000, but 4001, which gives me a little bit less flight time. So we have. 34% of battery. I don't know if you can see it, which is good. It's pretty hot. There's like 40 degrees outside, and uh, I'm just. I just want to check. Just want to check after this flight how hot is the EDF and the ESC, especially. Okay, it's uh, pretty cool down here. The motor is a little hot, but nothing unusual, nothing scary. So yeah, perfect, amazing, I love it. I love the, the way it flies, the way it handles fast, slow speed, uh, aerobatic passes. And um, yeah, it's pretty, pretty fun to build and fly, um, amazing. Thank you for watching the video. I will very soon upload on the channel the build guide of the Venom and the file so you can build it by yourself. I'll leave all the important uh, links in the description and uh, thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel.